What's up everyone? Today I'm going to be talking about the Excel Super Coil Ignition Coil, the 14001. I'm going to give you some tips about it, what it's used for, how to wire it up, things of that nature. I currently am not using this. I got this off a car that I bought four or five years ago. Haven't touched it, haven't used it. But I'm going to give you a quick, simple rundown about it. Um, this ignition coil um, is good up to, I think, 45,000 volts. I'm not 100% sure on that, but I think so. On um, the top here, you see you have this plug wire. It's just like a spark plug wire, basically. That goes into the top of here. And then you have a negative and a positive. This cord right here that you see will plug into your distributor cap. Should be right on the top, usually in the center if I'm not mistaken. And then for your negative and your positive, your negative, which this is the negative side, your negative side will usually have your tachometer on it and the wire running from the bottom of your distributor will be going to the negative. To the positive side, you'll have one wire going to the starter and then one wire going to the ignition. Now the wire going to the ignition, you're going to want to run a resistor plate. Usually that would come with a nice coil. If you buy a nice coil, it'll come with a resistor plate that you will run the positive through the resistor plate and then to your ignition, um, to your ignition switch. That way when you kick on your switch, it's sending power here and to your starter and the whole works. So it's pretty simple. Two to the positive, two to the negative. The positive will have the, the ignition and the starter and the negative will have the tack and the distributor wire. Pretty simple. All the wires will probably be um, the two negative wires will be 18 gauge usually the, and the two positive wires will usually be 20 gauge. Um, if you install one of these ignition coils here on your ride you should um, expect to get a little better idle quality. It'll also give you quicker starts. You really won't see too much performance wise from it unless you have a faulty coil or your coil starting to go on it on your car then you might see a little performance but it's going to be very minute if not. Um, it's going to be hard to notice. Some people say they notice it others don't. You can go ahead and get a the MSD blaster, if you want, instead of this one, both about the same thing. It's pretty, pretty simple. There you have it. That's how you can wire up and use your Excel Super Coil. Thanks for stopping by. Check out my other videos. Hit that subscribe button. Till next time. Peace.